my name right here on our radio of Vanity Fair. People's Dispatch on the Lethality of U.S. Drone War. That'll be coming up after our commentary. And on the mission of Free My Guest. Like a man of two minutes ago, Victor Bastillas talks with Cuban American activist Carlos Lasso. He's the founder of Quintus de Amar, Bridges of Love, as Carlos and his delegation arrive in Rome following a walk through Italy to call for the end to Washington's blockade of Cuba. Very missing. And we can look a little later on this hour. We've got sports action with Abel Vasquez. And then Valletta rolls out some culture news with the folks around it. Stay with us here on Radio Havana Cuba. Don't touch that guy. And yes, we've got some international news and national news too. First, the national news with Captain Lopez. Thank you, with warm congratulations to the Cuban people, the president of the Cuban Island, Miguel Espanel Domingos, concluded the closing remarks of the eighth of the session of the ninth legislature of the Cuban Parliament on Wednesday. In taking stock of what the country has experienced, the president said its response to the many problems and challenges is comparable to an Olympic or world record. The head of state recalled that the island will be celebrating the 63rd anniversary of the revolution in a few days. And while it's fair to celebrate having overcome a tremendous year, he warned of the need to preserve the results obtained in the containment of COVID-19. It would be a mistake to believe that the good pandemic numbers we have now will last forever if we do not act responsibly and rationally enough to stop. He stressed the merit of overcoming the year's multiple challenges besides in the courage and talent of the Cuban people the source of all those who have contributed to the creative resistance on these trying times. As Fidel once said, someday we'll have to rise monument to the Cuban people. He stressed. The head of state said that 2021 was a great school of what the island can no longer and should no longer do and what it can and should do. He said that even the impossible will always be possible in Cuba. In his travels to the parliament, the Afghanistan spreads that Cuba is a country that promotes peace with ties of friendship and respect throughout the planet. 